friends, thanks for watching. If you're new here, my name is Marie. I am the owner and creator here at Soft Talk Reusables where we make reusable cloth menstrual pads. Today is a new release day in the shop, so I'm gonna bring you along. I'm gonna show you what that looks like, the kind of stuff that we do, and yeah, if you're interested, keep watching. So the first kind of stuff we usually have to do, we double check that all of the listings are set up and working on the website and ready to go live when the restock time is. But first, before that, we have a whole bunch of panty wraps here that we pushed through and finished yesterday that we got to count, take pictures of, get them listed. Usually we like to be super far ahead, but we've been out of stock of panty wraps for a long time. We finally got a whole bunch of fabric in, so we decided to push through and get that done so that we could list them during the release. So that's kind of the first thing. Jade's counting them now, and then I'm gonna go work on the computer and double check all the rest of the listings. Now we have all of these panty wraps here that need photos so we can have listing photos. We have this light box here because as you can see, we're in a bit of like a dingy basement. The photos don't turn out so well if we just, if we don't have anything extra. So we add, uh, have this photo box. It's not, maybe not like the best solution, but it's working for what we've got. So Jade's gonna take all those listing photos and I am going to go and sew some pad wrappers. It's like, it's 8.30 right now. Restock isn't until four o'clock. And aside from getting those listing photos done, we're basically done everything for the restock. Jade's gonna take care of that. And now it's just kind of moving on to a regular workday, getting the next stuff done. We have, we have this pizza and pie print that we've already sewn up all the pads. We just gotta make some pad wrappers and those are coming in like the next restock after the one for today. And that's the last thing for this rest that restock that needs to get made. And then yeah, I'll take you along the rest of the day. It's basically just gonna be a regular workday after this. So to make our pad wrappers, we have this PUL fabric, this waterproof fabric. We put the printed fabric on top and the edges get surged together. Once that's all done on both ends of every wrapper, both sides, then I'll go to the other machine and finish them off. To sew these pad wrappers, I take about an inch and a half to two inches, fold it over, take from the bottom, fold it up so that it's about maybe half an inch from the top. Make sure everything, I can feel all the layers are nice and smooth. And then I'm gonna sew the sides together, two straight lines down the side. Okay, so I got all those pad wrappers finished. Jade is now still taking pictures of all of the stuff that is coming in next week's release. She already finished all the panty wrap. These restock days, because we restock every two weeks, we're usually like quite far ahead. We do that all the time. We generally have a good system. So on restock days, there's not usually like a ton left that needs to be done. It's mostly just like, 
making sure everything is appropriate, you know, maybe the odd um, picture of stuff like Jade's doing now. So these days tend to just be sort of like random, do a whole bunch of different little task days like today. We're only not even 9.30 and I've done like five different <laughs> things already. And so now I have to I have a YouTube video coming out today. I just remember that I never made a, th never made a thumbnail for that. So I'm going to do that. And then we'll probably give the whole space a, a good refresh and clean because we'll have finished a whole bunch of different little projects we had that we were working on. So it's nice to give the space a nice and tidy refresh start before we get into the next thing. Cleaned up the space, everything is basically done. Jade is uploading the pictures for those panty wraps and making listings for like the next restock, doing that sort of stuff. So we have a bin full here of interlabial pads that are done. They just need all of the threads trimmed. So I'm just gonna do that so that I can have like a little bit of a easy task break, I guess, before I get into the next thing, which is gonna be creating some content. Okay, slight change of plans. Um, Jade pointed out to remind me that we are almost out of cut pre-cut backers. We like to have our backer fabric pre-cut. It makes it really quickly when it comes to actually making the product. So we're gonna do that. Our backer fabric comes on this like really big roll. So we're gonna basically cut a whole bunch of smaller pieces, layer them and use that to cut out the backers. So I'll show you how that how we do that. So we've cut out a ton of layers and now the next step, we're gonna stack them all so that we can have a big stack of layers to cut.
So we've cut and stacked all of those layers and just to like give you a reference, like this is how thick it is. It's something, what did I say, 51 layers in here, something like that. So now I'm going to make rectangles for how many uh, backers and the different sizes that we need. And We have this big hefty cutting machine that's gonna cut all the layers. And that is how we managed to get, you know, four, three to four weeks worth of backer fabric cut in like an hour and a half. So now I have backers cut. We've done all the odds and ends. Everything's ready for the restock. Um, it's like two, it's about an hour and a half away from the restock. I am just gonna edit some videos, make some, create some content, and I will come back right when, right before the restock is about to happen, so you guys can kind of see what happens there and how that goes. Okay, we are five minutes out from the release. Uh, everything is looking good so far. I'm kind of just waiting a couple more minutes. Right now there's eight visitors waiting on the rope site, which is kind of cool. We haven't even sent out a marketing email yet or anything. I'm going to check all of my social media platforms. Okay, we're two minutes out now. The marketing email is being sent. Just gonna make a quick Instagram story. Restock is now live. There are about 20 people that were waiting before the restock even went live, so it could be a quick one. There could be some sizes that sell out quickly. Who knows? I can never predict it. We do try to continually make more and more products so that it doesn't sell out super fast, but sometimes it's out of our control. Okay, so it is four o'clock now, which is when the restock is supposed to go live. Let's go to the site, double check that everything listed. It's like everything is up there. Let's go check. Ooh, we got up to 22 people on the site now. 23, five active carts. Let's see how long it takes for the first order to come in. Oh, we've got 35 people on the site, 40. The numbers are picking up. We've got a bunch of active carts. Our restocks in the past, um, like say a year ago now, were crazy hectic. We would have like so many people on the site and everything would sell out really quickly, which is interesting because um, overall the business has grown like almost triple, even though on restock day things aren't quite as hectic. They still do really well, they're just not quite as hectic. But the biggest difference is that now we have a more steady stream of orders. We have stock available pretty much all the time. So that really helps. First one, let's see. Um, Gabriella, our first order number, number 5042. We have another one. 404 is when our first orders came in. We got two that came in at the same time. We got 55 people on the website, a whole bunch of carts. Anyway, I'm not gonna hang out here too long, but that's kind of how our restock day looks for us. It's pretty much like any other work day with just a handful of little extra restock related things, just double checking that everything is set up. And that's just because we're, again, like I said before, we're usually really far ahead and prepared. Um, we restock every single, or every two weeks, so we do this a lot. We have the system kind of down pat and have everything figured out. If you liked watching this or if you liked hanging out with us, let me know and I can do this again. Thanks again for watching and give it a like, a comment. It really helps the channel out a lot. We appreciate it. And thanks again, until the next one.